Hello and welcome back to another recipe video. On the menu today is beef noodle soup. This is a very mild but flavour packed recipe where we're going to serve beef strips and beef balls in a very tasty soup on a bed of rice noodles. This is kind of like a Thai version of Vietnamese pho, which I've probably horribly mispronounced there, but that's what it reminded me of when I was eating it the first time. On screen now are the ingredients. There's a lot of ingredients used to obtain the very complex flavour, so I've broken them down into ingredients needed for the soup and ingredients needed for the beef noodles. We're going to assume that you've already made the beef balls, but if you need to know how to make those, I'll link to that video at the end of this video. And to get full details on the ingredients, just visit our blog post. I'll post a link to that in the description box just below this video. So first we need to soak 70 grams of rice noodles in cold water for about 10 minutes. Whilst the noodles are soaking, dissolve one beef stock cube in two and a half litres of boiling water. When the stock cube has completely dissolved, add the soup ingredients, so one cinnamon stick, half a whole onion, half a carrot, three star anise seeds, one pickled garlic, one teaspoon of salted soybeans, one preserved bean curd, one and a half tablespoons of dark soy sauce, half a teaspoon of peppercorn, quarter teaspoon of coriander seeds, one and a half tablespoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of sugar, and half a tablespoon of salt. Give everything a stir and heat on a high heat. Once the water begins to boil, cover the pot with a lid and leave to cook for about 30 minutes. Whilst the soup is boiling for 30 minutes, you can make the beef balls if you don't already have any made. Once again, I'll link to the video guide on how to make those beef balls at the end of this video. So once the soup has been boiling for 30 minutes, just lower the heat and remove the lid. Now we'll prepare our noodles, so bring a saucepan of water to the boil, then add 70 grams of rice noodles which equals one portion. If you want more than one portion, just cook each portion separately. Cook until the noodles are done, which should only take about five minutes. You'll know that they're done when they appear very white. Then scoop the noodles out of the pan and into a bowl and mix with a dash of fried garlic oil to stop the noodles from sticking together. Now half fill a ladle with some of our soup and add the beef strips. Lower the ladle into the hot soup and cook the beef strips to your liking. Then place them in the bowl on top of the noodles that we just cooked. Now place the beef balls onto the ladle and lower the beef balls into the soup. We just want them to absorb some of the soup and heat up, so you don't need to do this for very long. Once they are hot, put them back in the bowl with the beef strips and the noodles. And spoon some of the soup over your noodles, beef strips and beef balls, taking care not to take out any of the chunks. We only added the onion, carrot and star anise for their flavour, so we don't want to get any of them into the bowl. So just make sure that you're only spooning out the liquid from the soup. And then finally, add the garnish of your choice. We used bean sprouts, spring onion, coriander, fried garlic oil, pepper, dried chili flakes, and ground peanuts, but feel free to use whatever you want. And then serve and enjoy. So on screen now is the link to our video which shows you how to make meatballs. In the video we used minced pork, so just substitute that for minced beef. Thanks for watching, we hope you enjoyed this recipe. Do give it a try and let us know what you think. If you'd like to see more Thai-inspired recipes, hit subscribe, and we hope to see you again on the next video.